What is it constantly making people return to this game? Over the last few weeks, I've been hearing and seeing the same statement, and it's, I've played this game before and now I'm back. But why? What's so special about this game that keeps making players return? For those of you that don't know, this is Will to Live Online, an open world MMO RPG survival first person shooter. And just so you know, it's free to download on Steam and there's a link in the description. Set in a post-apocalyptic wasteland, inhabited by mutants and monsters, your goal is to loot, hunt, gain skills, craft, and overall, survive. Now there are a few reasons why I personally can't stop playing this game, starting with the graphics. Everything from the look of the land to the mechanics of the weapons is very aesthetically pleasing. I've said before in another video that the changing weather adds a lot of immersion to the game, but besides that, it always makes the game look stunning. Whether you're in the pitch black of night, the pouring rain or the heat of full sunlight, the graphics never disappoint and will be sure to keep you immersed in the game. The same goes for the weapon graphics and animations. The weapons in this game are super realistic and that paired with the super smooth and realistic animations are very pleasant. Now moving on to the skills. There are a certain amount of skills in Will to Live Online, for example mining, crafting and medicine skills. Not only do these skills offer in-game benefits like being able to craft higher level armor or healing more effectively, but they in themselves offer different routes of play and different ways to level up and make money. The next thing I want to talk about is PvP. PvP is a really big part of Will to Live Online and I think it's the number one reason that keeps bringing back more of the experienced players. Whether attacking or defending bases at Canyon or just doing scrims at Karovi, people love doing PvP on this game. Lastly, the thing that I think is what brings the majority of people back is the game itself. Now I know that sounds silly and obvious, but hear me out. This game has many maps and areas to explore. So many passageways, so many quests, monsters, things to make and craft, and it just looks and feels fantastic. So I don't think there is one thing in particular that keeps bringing people back to this game, but it's a culmination of the many things that this great game has to offer. But maybe I'm wrong. Let me know in the comments what you think. And if you want to know if this game is worth the download, then click on the video on the screen now, and I'll see you in the next one.